Hi everyone, I'm Patrick and I'm back today with the Kia at Willowbank. Um, so today is quite an exciting day for us because we are going to try something brand new with the Kia. We've got a touchscreen, which is something they've never actually used at all before. And today we're going to find out how they respond to it and if it's something that's viable for us. Um, if we can get them using the screens, it's something that's going to be excellent for our research. It opens up so many new avenues of studies that we're going to be able to run with these birds. So it's something that's really exciting for us and I'm really hoping it's going to go well. So what we've got is a touch screen laptop and we've made just a small enclosure to go around it, protect it a little bit because otherwise we know these birds would just tear it apart in a matter of seconds. To protect the screen for these initial tests at least, we are also just wrapping it in a couple of layers of cling film, you know, just to give it that little bit of extra protection. So, um, with it safely inside, today we just have an image of some peanut butter on the screen, and we've got some actual peanut butter that we're going to smear on the screen in front of it, and we're just going to see A, if they're comfortable interacting with it, and B, if they will actually activate the screen when they touch it, um, which is a little bit of a concern for us because their beak is like our nails. It won't necessarily um, activate the screen when they tap it. What we're hoping is they're going to start using their tongue, which is why licking peanut butter off the screen is such a good first step. So the first impressions look pretty good. Um, they're interacting with the screen, um, but we've noticed something that we already expected might be a problem, which is that there is a lot of glare out when we start using these outside. Today's a bright sunny day. It's beautiful, but it's not the best for viewing a screen. So we've just made a temporary little sun shield to go over the top out of a spare cardboard box. It already looks much clearer and we're just going to see how they interact with it. So it's still pretty promising. They're a little more cautious with having um, a cardboard box over the top but they're eventually, once they start sticking their head into it, they seem quite comfortable um, and they are licking the screen and we can see that it's being activated, which is really, really good. That's exactly what we wanted to see today. So the next steps for this um, touchscreen project, we're going to have to build a more permanent sun shield, obviously, and we're also just going to have to build a little bit of an applet that's going to have a bit more of a challenge for them so we can reward them for actually touching the correct object on screen rather than it just being a reward for licking the screen at all. But to find out what happens with that, um, we'll have to wait until the next video. So if you want to see that, be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you know exactly when it goes live. Um, thanks for joining us again and I will see you all for that one very soon. Thank you. Bye.